Hello everyone, it's Gengar1122 here. We're going to be playing Yugo Castle Monsters Coliseum. Unlike last time where the audio wasn't working for me, it will be working this time around, so let's go ahead and do Voltage Cage. Dungeon Dice Monsters, so I'm a game expert myself. Let's see who's the real king of games. I challenge you to a duel. I accept your challenge, Duke Devlin. When I win, all will hail the new champion. It's time to duel! Oh, uh, what uh, attack first, actually? Since I, you do can be really good if you if you let him go first, honestly. So we're going to go first so we, he doesn't like destroy our castles while our monsters are still in them. Okay, here's what we'll use. Uh, do we have an, how much do you take? 16.9? Oh, monster points 100. Which is fine, honestly. Let's have a couple of happy lovers. Um, I guess we'll have a couple of flame vipers and for our last monster. Which we need, it would cost 40, so we'll just do a Kariba. Okay, let's let's see what he has. Still scorpions and three Kuribos. Okay. Let's grab some of our happy lovers. And I think we I think we go ahead here and just summon our like a dragon while we have the AP to do so, so. I don't think Queen Viper will get hit since it's all the way at the right, behind my capsules. So it should be good. Find Viper, let me see. How much can Happy Lover move? Not quite far enough. So let me see where everything else can move. You. Okay, Kribos. You can move there. And this one. Okay, I'm fine for the moment. Yeah, I think we'll just move one with like a dragon, and we'll end turn.
Okay, if I did that, how much could Wicked Dragon do? 106. A little bit of damage, but not quite enough. Okay, now where can the Kuribo move? Can move right here, which puts me in range of Happy Lover. And this one will put me in range of Happy Lover. So I just need to move both my Happy Lovers, which I'll do so by moving this one right here. And we'll move this Happy Lover right here. And can I be attacked? No. Yeah, we'll enter. Okay, now that we got that settled, I think it's time to start attacking. Now, can I attack? Yes, I think that's what I'll do. Got it. We'll move Kuribo in and take down his still scorpion. Flame Viper here. Let's move Flame Viper in to attack. Okay, you know I'll take I'll take some damage doing this, but it's fine. I don't think Steel Scorpion can attack me anyway, so. Now let's move Happy Lover in, like, way right here. Jeez, how can I win now? The boy is so you don't win. So. <laughs> oh, and he's going to attack my Wicked Dragon, which is perfectly fine. Oh, that's not good. Okay, I think I know what I'll do. We're, we'll go ahead right here. We'll attack Kribo, which will do 110. And we'll move Happy Lover in. I'll get hit by Steel Scorpion, but that's fine. It's better off getting rid of Kribo so it doesn't do more damage. Okay. And let's go ahead and attack Steel Scorpion, do 83. Under 32. And this will finish Kuribo off. So really, this fight is really going really swimming way right now. A blue flame viper right here. And that will end our turn. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, this looking dragon. This is what's gonna let me turn this duel upside down. Well, that's actually really unfortunate. I knew I knew Wicked Dragon was going to go down anyway, but still. <laughs> actually, did I? I think I actually missed that one. Actually, no, I think I. Uh, oh well, it's fine.
Well, this will finish it off regardless. As you just saw, this is a very simple fight to do, honestly. Back to the drawing board. Yugi, you really are the king of games. You're not too bad yourself. I lost, but I don't regret a thing because I dueled my best. Yugi, keep at it and win the tournament. Thanks. Alright, so in the next video, we'll be facing Taya Gardner. So this is where we're going to end the video here. So if you all enjoyed the video, please leave a like, we'll have the channel, subscribe if you're new. I'll thank you for watching. See you all next time. Bye bye, everyone.